right, welcome back to a typical day here in Malaysia. It is about to storm. I don't know, I don't know if you can see that. We just saw a massive lightning strike. So we might get rained on, but we are walking to the new TRX mall here. It's Do you hear that thunder? It's about 800 meters to the mall. So we've got to get 800 meters before the storm starts. And I just heard the thunder go off again. And honestly, it doesn't look very promising. <laughs> It looks a little bit blue in the camera that actually is in real life. Ooh. Oh, no. We're definitely gonna, we're gonna get rained on. Probably, yeah. We can't. We'll figure it out. We, we, we got, we're probably on 650 meters by now. Oh, hopefully. <laughs> and I also just randomly got a headache like straight away just then for some reason. Someone said the other day that the headache is likely because of the heat. Uh, uh, which is so true. Like true. Because we keep moving from aircon to heat all the time. Yeah. And we're not used to it. So we are heading now to the mall and I have to quickly just give a disclaimer here. I don't actually really like going to malls. <laughs> I'm just interested in what this one's like because it's literally brand new it here. It's so hyped as well. And, it, and it, everyone in my comments, go to TRX, go to TRX. Okay, not everyone, a and few people. And every little bit of social media that you go on. It's like TRX mall. Feet, it's just like TRX, TRX, TRX. So we're going to check it out. But honestly, like shopping, I don't like it. I have like a very money cross cross cross, cross 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 i have a very money scarcity mindset so for me going to the malls i never buy anything so i'm like why am i here you know <laughs> you know what i mean and if i do buy something i regret it because I, like I hate spending money <laughs> difference in culture like this is he coming to malaysia malaysia has a mall culture yeah like don't let's not Where pretend it doesn't we can go we can go this way okay are you sure yeah let's not pretend it doesn't right like it's got a mall culture by the way let my hair cut yeah, we like it. But my beer's really short. I like it like that. Yeah, so Malaysia's got a mall culture. That's just the way it is. So when you come to KL, check out the malls. It's part of it, it's part of it, right? Can you hear the thunder? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Also, I didn't ask you, I asked them. <laughs> one last bit though, one last bit though. We, um, we talk about um, malls and the way we talk about them. Because in Australia, every mall is identical. You yeah. have the same shops in them. And we mainly shop online, and you go to the like to the shopping center when you want mall thunder. Like a specific store, like you want to go to Cotton On, you want to go to General Pants, you go to the mall, and I want to buy some jeans today. That sort of thing, right? We don't go for like a day out, like yeah. people do here. You go to the mall for a purpose, generally. The yeah, mall, uh, we yeah. call it shopping center. Shopping center. Well, we call them malls now because we travel so much. Yeah. I say mall to my parents, and they're like, what? what? <laughs> yeah, so it's very American. They say. calls them malls when we spent two years in Asia. So. So yeah, they're malls now, but they're shopping centers. Um, but we're just walking through sort of like the back sort of streets near Bukit Bing Tang, um, but the opposite way now, I think. But we're trying to we're trying to rush through to beat this storm, but yeah. Inside before the rain starts, we'll be fine. We're only now. And then what? We're gonna take a car home from there. Yeah, we're gonna grab back home. All right. Anyway, you guys, you know it's Vlogmas. As usual, like and subscribe to the channel if you like. And if you want to subscribe, <laughs> anyway. It's action if you want to do it. No one's forcing you. It's yeah. a free country. Well, free channel, I guess. It's my channel. You're free to do anything you want. Like, like, and subscribe if that's what you want to do. Anyway, oh, what are you doing? All right, I, I, this, this thunderstorm has, it's still thundering. It's been thundering for five minutes. Yeah, I think we'll be okay. <sighs> we got about five hundred minutes to go. Oh, there was lightning. <laughs> Oh gosh, guys. All right. <laughs> Are we going to make it? Are we going to make it? So Michael saying, which, what's it called? I think this is in the area. So where, I don't think we've actually so walked through. Like, I can smell the durian. Yeah, I smell the durian like, too, wherever smell that's coming from. You got a couple little things yeah, on the, along right the way. Here. Yeah, you can, you, smell, you can smell the durian from a literal mile away. Um, but the thing is, the thing is, uh, gonna pour, I can, you hear the thunder, it's non-stop. It's a cool little place to walk through. We're just trying to rush to get there, basically. I this part of the town. No, neither. I was just thinking that. I Locals, think I... can you tell us, is this an older part of town? Because the, some of the buildings are really new and some of them are really old. So I'm assuming this is one of the first yeah. parts of town, maybe. Oh, my headache, guys. This is a really cool spot, actually, to be honest with you. Oh, it's cool. Yeah, it is cool. All like oh, these little restaurants here. Left. Uh, left, this way. Down the street here. Okay. Yeah, I like this area. I like this stuff. This guy's selling coconuts. Ooh. Oh, they're so talented. You know what I mean? Yeah, totally. Look at them all. 
I am coconutted out after traveling for so long. Except for Sri Lankan king coconuts. Oh, Sri Lankan king I coconuts. I go on them were, every day. They're amazing, but this is a cool oh, little water, water, water thing. Does it feel like your bottle? Oh, I'm back there from India. Oh, really? Yeah. Some more coconuts. Must be the thing to have here. Yeah. Some more, another water store. This is sick. Yeah, heaps of coconuts. I wish we could stop. We have to get to this mall. I want to, we have not much time before it rains. I don't want to get stuck in the rain. It's a cool place though. I like this very much. Hey, can I say something for your commenters? Uh, I don't know. It depends on what you're going to say. <laughs> no, someone's, there's just some really educational co uh, comments recently about Malaysia, which has been awesome. Yeah. Basically, um, mamak is the word that Malaysia has used to refer to Tamil Indians. Oh. So that's why they call mamak food stock shops. Okay. We have to go oh. this way and then this way. Okay. Um, which is cool. That I didn't know that. Happy. But then I just we walked past a my mark and it reminded me of it. That's something we just, you just wouldn't know. Yeah, true. So thank you. So this is the I think back entrance, I'm pretty sure. You got this massive Christmas tree. Those baubles are massive. They're probably the size of my head or actually bigger once you get there. And then you come and invite me in with something I can't afford. <laughs> Prada and Balenciaga. <laughs> Not very attainable. <laughs> now nah, they all do that, they all do that. But it actually looks cool. Looks cool. This is a cool it's like walking place out the out the front and everything. So yeah, let's go inside, shall we? So while it does look brand new. It smells brand new. Smell that you're right. It smells like paint. It still smells like paint. Um, it just looks like pavilion to me so far. And we've come into the side that has all the like fancy which I never shop in, so let's go, to, let's go to somewhere where I normally shop. I don't own one piece of um, brand name, anything. So let's find somewhere else that maybe we would actually buy from. <laughs> it looks cool though. It looks, it looks new. It looks like any other mall in Malaysia so far. Yeah, malls are a weird one with me because like in five years time, it's not going to look new. Yeah, true. But I think Pavilion's done well, that new little area. Yeah. Looks new. Yeah, I'm looking for some food, but this just looks like fancy food street. <laughs> no, can't be. Too big and too new just to do that. Well, this is just a little, little market food place too. Duncan, yeah, here we go. Bruce, yeah. No restaurants, kind of just food. Yeah, fast stuff food. Huh? Is that a Paris baguette? What do you think? Paris baguette. Oh, Paris baguette, yeah, okay. Um, so I guess this is more of your like, faster food, kind of cheaper. Faster food, cheaper. Tried to, uh, yeah, anyway, um, I can't find, I need some food, I need some food, but. It's a lot of space, there's a lot of space. Yeah. Okay, interesting. Everyone's taking photos. Boost, boost juice. We actually had a boost last night, so I don't feel like a boost right now. But All I love boost. You, fresh, fresh baked cookies. What was that? All about you, fresh baked cookies. Pretty cool, actually. I can't find like a true. Uh, That's like a, what you have in. It's like a food court. Oh, like... food exchange. Hey, tea. Food exchange. Okay, so maybe in here. Let's go in here. Yeah, I guess so. All right. I'm not sure. Yeah. See anything that you want? No, I don't want anything, I want to eat. Okay. So this is one of the ones where you like grab all the things that you want. It's got all the, like the noodles back there and all the filling kind of things. And you just kind of like boil your own dish. Pretty cool. Yeah, you pick all your... This is probably the best out of the... Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. The best out of the more food courts I've seen. Yeah, definitely. It's very obviously new. <laughs> but the seats, there's heaps of seats. And it's not even full sushi. Right there. Oh, but it, I never have chicken. I like Aussie sushi, which is chicken and avocado. Aussie sushi, which <laughs> is not really sushi. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite though. Hi, um, the katsu roll. Can I please get four? Yes, yes. This is the closest one to an Australian sushi. We normally put like avocado and stuff in there, but that's the closest option. Just the four, yeah. Can I pay on card? Okay, perfect. And uh, Jeff Coke Zero? Coke Zero? 
a Coke, zero. Okay, just just one Coke, please. Oh, you don't sell it? Okay, that's all right, just those ones, thank you. <laughs> Terima kasih. All right, this is a bit confusing, but that's okay. Do I go up there? I don't know. This is a lot. So yeah, that's the closest to Australian sushi. Um, hopefully when I go home next, I'll get to show you like my chicken and avo sushi that I have when, I, when I'm home, because it's honestly one of my favorite foods. Um, but I never see it anywhere. The only other place I've seen it is Bali, because it's obviously catered to Australians. So yeah, but it's a very big mall. Like, there is a lot of space everywhere. I'm kind of, I'm enjoying it. I just, I just don't like walking around shops endlessly with no, with no aim and especially shops I don't know where to go. I feel like it's like a waste of time just walking around and I don't like walking for too long because my back gets sore. I broke it a few years ago so Michael just messaged me. He's like down there, found us a seat but let's buy the sushi. When it's my turn in line. <laughs> All right, there are so many options for food. Like, like so many <laughs> so we you want a come quick back. and easy right yeah we want a quick and easy it costs like four dollars for four of these um and there is just so many places to get food you could come here oh, every yeah it looks little, really good eh? No, the little tank soy sauce oh, it yeah. used to it being a fish it cost a uh, dollar uh one ring at 20 or 20 something cents. 30 40 I'm, cents i'm used to that being a fish yeah is it a fish in your country yeah ours is a little fish like soy sauce wait why is it a fish then I guess because soy sauce goes on sushi, which is fish, which is chicken. True. Anyway, so this is look, looks good. And now but I walked past all these places that had like roti and like fried chicken and like all this stuff. And I'm like drooling. So I wish that we maybe tried other things as well. That doesn't look like chicken. Uh, what is that? A prawn? Oh, damn. It's yeah. still nice. Okay. <laughs> okay, that's not what we have in... Australia then. <laughs> I thought it was chicken. Damn. Well, katsu. Katsu is normally pork or chicken, right? Except it wouldn't be that. It would be chicken. Wow. Well, cool. I don't right. know. Well, I wish that we had like a whole day to explore here, but I also don't like walking around for the whole day. Anyway, we're going to eat this with some of this and then probably I'll show a little bit more of the mall because we just walked in. All right. So we are, we are up the top again now and i'm still hungry two pieces of sushi but it is it is uh it's not as busy like there's a lot of people here don't get me wrong but i thought it would be like busier the mall must be massive i'm sure half the city came here in the last two weeks yeah we kind of left it for a little bit because it was so, it was going to be so busy but you have got i mean it all just looks fancy doesn't it i'm not sure of any if there's any anything special yeah or even any like i don't know there's sephora up there which is kind of standard. And there's like all your sports stores upstairs. Honestly, what's different about it than any other mall? <laughs> yeah, it is pretty similar to Pavilion. And KLCC. It, yeah, and KLCC actually, true. Which has probably become my favorite mall now. I love KLCC, yeah. to be honest. It has Roti Boy. <gasps> is there Roti Boy here? I don't know, remember? There's no Roti Boy in any of them. Find, find, find an information desk. <laughs> find it right now. Drunk Elephant Store on its own? No. No, it's it's severely overpriced, but that's very interesting. <laughs> Whoa, nice. Oh, should I grab mum's stuff here? Uh, yeah, you, you need um lo uh, body shop though. This is Bath and Body Works. Yeah, but just similar smell, like something different for her. It's the uh, yeah. What smell does she like? You know. I don't know. I Do don't you know, know it? No, I don't know it. It's green. I don't know. It's from the wrong, a different shop. Is yeah, I know, but that like that's lavender. Smell. Yeah, cool. Uh, I don't. I don't know. Hello, sorry. <laughs> This is like an American store. I have no idea what they have. Okay then. This might be cool. Into the night. Oh, I just shoved that in my. Well, that smells really good, actually. I low-key like that smell a lot. Hmm. I sprayed it on my chin. I like that smell, actually. Warm sugar. I like that one, it's not good. I'll put this in my bag anyway, so it's no? good. Okay. Yeah. Alright. Thank you. I like this one. Yeah. I like it a lot. Alright, so we've got Sephora with the things. There was a question about a mall. Yeah. Guys, in Malaysia and most of Southeast Asia, the culture of a staff member is to just like hang slightly around you and follow you around the store but don't say anything. Yeah. 
do you guys like that? Yeah. Because we don't. And yeah. it's, not that, it's not that we think it like the person's being rude. We understand that's how it works here. Customer service in Australia is very much like... Say hello, but leave me alone. It's very much, how are you going? If you need anything, let me know. Yes. And I'll leave you alone to look. Yeah. So we feel very like crowded when that happens and, and it puts me off. Yeah, same. But, but it's not that person's fault, that's how it works here. Yes. I just wonder if and you guys find it the same as us, a little bit like or pressuring is or is it normal? Yeah, look, there's a, there's a lot of shops that I'm not familiar with, a lot of shops that I am, but yeah, I'm struggling to find why it's any different. I mean, I don't know, tell me, some, some places at my, in my home, right there. what? Right there. What? This guy's got a massive gun. Oh, does he? Oh my god, he does. <laughs> oh my god. The shotgun. Or maybe he's got a pellet turn or something in the bullets. He just has a he just has a gun in the middle of the like, What? What? That you can't do that in Australia, can you? Call maybe. me please. Maybe. Cool. I don't know if you saw that. I can't point it out because YouTube won't like it. But like that guy just had a I'm not massive rifle. They're in front of the, they're in front of a super expensive jewelry store. I'm not against that, but like. A lot. Anyway, yeah, I'm struggling. I mean, for me, when I'm at home, I know certain malls or shopping centers have certain shops, and I know that I can't get some in some Ooh. shops. I can get some in others. Opening in January, Baskin and Robbins. Right. Oh, and Benefit, Baskin and Robbins. Um, I wanted to see if they have Roti Boy. Let's have a look. Um, yeah, that is actually really smart. Roti. I reckon it's too new for Roti Boy. Roti. Yeah, it's too new for us. No! I'll have to get dropped at the one. Come on, Roadie Boy. Well, like I said earlier, or maybe in the previous vlog, we are leaving in like a day or two. Yeah. Leaving Kuala Lumpur in like a day or two. So I want some Roti Boy before we leave. So I'm going to have to there go somewhere else. There is one in Johor, like right next to a hotel. No, I want some now as well, just in case. <laughs> yeah, anyway, so I'm, what I'm saying is, is like maybe this store, this mall has different um, shops than other ones, but I can't see that right, right yet. Yeah. Oh, Gongcha somewhere, maybe. I don't know. Pretty cool though. So a lot of the shops aren't open yet, as you can see, opening in December, opening in December, opening in December. So a lot of them, obviously, because it's so brand new, oh, that's cool, the place to sit and do, because it's so brand new, aren't open yet. Which is totally fine. You've got Reebok, Asics, North Face, Hydro. Hydro Plus has its own store. Yeah. That's oh, pretty cool. One thing cool about this place, I will say, um, this is where the first official Apple store in oh, Malaysia is going to be. So that actually about? is awesome. Not open yet. Yeah. But Malaysia needs an Apple store. For sure. Only for like, it has like machines and the official resellers, but you just feel more yeah, comfortable yeah, yeah. where you're going and you're like getting it fixed at an Apple store or something. Um, yeah, look, I wanted to find Sephora, but I feel like we just. It was down there because there were signs and we went up, but yeah. I just don't know where anything is, which is standard because I've never been here before. But this one looks like the sports, sports level. Area. You've got Crocs, Asics, Reebok, North Face. Sketches. So for me, hmm. where I'm kind of, where I kind of am here, it's like, why would I come here over Pavilion when Pavilion's like right on a couple of subway lines? Maybe it's, there's an MRT around here that I don't know yeah, about. Yeah, I was gonna say. I shouldn't say that if I don't know, but like, I don't know. I mean, it's cool. It is I cool. Guess, I guess the disconnect here is that we're struggling to understand why these mini malls are needed, but then you look here and it's full of people. So yeah. obviously people love this, love this, so There's awesome. Foot Locker, Stretchers, Sketches, sorry, MBT. There's just a whole bunch of um, sports here, which is not my jam. So maybe we'll look at another level or go somewhere else. I like the sports. Yeah, I know, but you're gonna come. Are you gonna buy a thing? Go, go have a look then. Nah, I can't fit in my bag. That's what I thought. My bag's bursting at the seams. Oh, there's a walkthrough. Can I walk through? Walk through? Yeah, walk through. yeah, let's see what's over here. Yeah, look. I just don't know my way around yet, but it is brand new. Like, it's pretty cool. But again, there's so many malls here. I don't know. I'm, I'm losing track. <laughs> so, if I was to rank favorite malls, or you were to rank top three malls in Malaysia, what would it be? What's KLCC. Yes, okay, I not one for you yet. Um, and then Pavilion. For me it goes KLCC, Lao Yat, Pavilion. Yeah. I Ooh, there's like, a Dyson store. I just like, um, I like Lao Yat. I like what it's got. I like oh, that for, this? I like, like that. a little outdoor thing. Let's I like that for electronics. Yeah. I, I haven't seen electronics um, here yet, but oh, obviously sure there, there would be. Yeah. So but there's there a Dyson the store down there. Would be the same. This is a little outside area. Maybe this leads to going like leaving, which we don't want to do yet. 
I don't know. Oh, cool. So it's kind of like huh. a viewing platform I'd say as where you can look out over the city. Okay, that's cool. And some bars and restaurants and things. Bars here. and restaurants. Oh yeah, Flamingo. Okay. Yeah, see, more opening soon. Whatever that, is that a, what is that? They're lining up for something. Or is that the movie I don't know. I'm saying, well, basically what I'm saying is everything's opening soon. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, this looks cool. What? I think that's your biggest fan. What? I think that's your biggest fan. Tipsy Flamingo. Oh. That is not funny. <laughs> that is not funny. <laughs> I could have worded it better. <laughs> so, there's a VCR here which is crazy. Because it means they must be doing really, really well, right? That's that coffee shop we went to in one of the first videos over here. Um, but something juicy, they must be doing really well because I was talking to my barber, who you guys also saw in an earlier video, and they were saying, talking about TRX and saying they inquired about putting a barber shop here. This is the only big mall they're not in. Yeah. And they said it costs 50,000 ringgit a month <gasps> for a barber size, barber shop size place here. And he's like, we just don't make enough money from our, <gasps> our business model. You, you go. Yeah, we don't make enough money from our business model to do that. So they didn't come here for that reason. So VCR must be making a killing if they can Look afford how big to be that here. Is. What is that size too from barbershop? That's not right, is it? What? 15, 16 grand a month. Which is actually quite cheap for a mall in Australia, but like I suppose you got more foot traffic oh. than an Australia mall, don't you? Maybe there's so many malls here, I don't know. You know Wait, what? So that's a cafe. That's Should we get a coffee? That's VCR. <laughs> you know what? Go in and see what, if they're charging more than a normal coffee. Because I want to see if they're trying to if like what the markup would be. So I get a coffee? Yeah, get a coffee. Okay. You get your card? Yeah, I'll, I'll tap this. Oh, wait, I, I guess I'm getting a coffee. You know what? I'm not going to say no to a coffee, that's for sure. Let's have a look. Can I order here? Hi, so... Um, I might get a... Oh, we've got 18 ring at 16, 14. Can I get an iced uh, latte? Please? Yes, please. No sugar. No sugar. Perfect. Just the way I like it. <laughs> Take away, please. That's off. Ah, oh, tax. Ring it. Ring it tax. Sure. Can I pay on my card? Is that all right? Thank you. Terracassi. Uh, yeah, uh, well, for a long time. Yeah. <laughs> oh, good. This is my fourth time, I think. Yeah, fourth time. Yeah. <laughs> I came for my birthday um, in July. I went to Langkawi. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Nice beaches. <laughs> Thank you, Tamar Cassie. Thank you. All right. So we have. Oh, I got a. I got a. What do you. Oh, I can't go that way. <laughs> I've got a. Uh, what do you call it? I don't know the name of this. Oh my goodness, I do this so much. Beer bar, I don't know. I got a beer bar, so I'll go back in a second. Um, so it was 16 ringgit. So that's a bit more expensive. A than tiny bit more, but yeah. then there was tax of 96 ringgit. So 96 ringgit? 90, 90 cents. 90, 0.96. One ringgit, okay. I can't do oh, maths. Yeah. I thought you guys had a $30 tax then. <laughs> I'm not good at numbers, so that... <laughs> so apparently I was just reading, there is a, a massive, um, uh, garden on the roof, rooftop garden. So I'll we'll go and see that, that, and then I think we would have seen most of what the mall has to offer. I wanted Most to see, want to see, I wanted to see Sephora, if I'm being honest, but I'm not going to buy out. anything because it's yeah. too expensive. Yeah. We might have a look, a quick look. Maybe, we'll go upstairs first though, just okay. before it rains. Yeah, so yeah, 16, just under 17 yeah. ringgit for a coffee. I mean, I guess, I guess 19,000 Australian dollars isn't that much for a business if you're doing good turnover, which it looks like they probably would, being a good coffee shop in a mall. So so my bank or my thing just told me that was $5.44, which is pretty it's standard. Right, it's standard, is it? Sometimes, yeah. yeah. The one from downstairs in our place is $4 you something. there's a huge markup on, on coffee shops make a lot of money, you mark up though. Yeah, of course. Um, mainly if you buy food, that's when they make their money. Sometimes, depends on where you go, but coffees can cost $8 at home. Yeah. Australian. Yeah, and if someone's offering cheap coffee, it's normally because they're trying to get you in to buy their food, which is where they make their money. Yeah. Anyway, it's cool. I don't, I don't mind it. I just, I just, I, yeah, I'm struggling to see why there's another mall, but 
No, I, obviously there's, there's demand for it. Yeah, there's people. And everywhere. we've been in the other malls the last few days since we've yeah. been here, and we, all the other malls have been busy too. Yeah, you're right. You're there's right. Clearly a demand for it. And, it's and really new. Like it feels nice to be here. It does feel nice. Yeah. I mean, if this opened in in our town, we would all flock to it. Oh and yeah, look of course. One hundred percent. I guess it's just the the whole mall culture of being super excited about it is like. And I'm just like. Different. I personally, as a person, don't like going to a mall if I don't know exactly where everything yeah. I want to go is because I don't like walking around. And again, that's the difference. That's the difference. In Australia, you go to the mall to buy something in particular, yeah, yeah. and in places like like Malaysia, you go to the mall to have a full experience, which True. they do it better than anyone else. So why not? One hundred percent. I um, yeah, I have a headache, but just waiting for my coffee. They were so friendly too. She goes, "You're traveling to Malaysia." I was like, yeah, "It's like my fourth time," and then I was like, "She's like fourth time." And I was like, "Yeah." And then everyone was like around, like talking to me, which is cool. I like it. Everyone's so friendly. Woo! Ah, over here. It's <laughs> beeping. Thank you. Have a nice day. Thank you, you too. Do you need tissue? Awesome. No, do you have a straw? Oh, over there. Thank you so much. Have a good day. All right, straw is over here. Oh, there's a, wind there's a mirror there. <laughs> you guys can see me without. Oh. I'm not doing well with this straw. Oh guys, I'm struggling. There we go. <laughs> Why is this so hot? <laughs> Have a nice day. I sure will. All right, let's go have a look at this upstairs area. And then we'll, I don't know, I want to have a look at Sephora. All right, let's go. So I just also read that there is a MRT station literally attached to this. That's what maybe they're lining up for. Yeah, maybe, yeah. Oh, so, that's so, that's that's handy. Well, it's only for the MRT, so you still have to find a cross yeah, true. section to get here. So it might take you a long time from some parts of the city. Like for us, for example, there was no like direct, direct line, way yeah. without walking for two kilometers from our house. Yeah, true. Cool coffee. Have a nice day. You'll find out how to get on the roof. Yeah, true. How we get on the roof? Yeah, I don't know how to get up there. Okay, it's raining. But this bit. is the outside area which you can still hear the construction. Oh, up. oh it's over there, okay. Pretty cool. Yeah. Oh look at that. Oh a little a cool look like, jumpy area. Uh playground up up there. Let's go up those stairs. Okay. It looks yeah. like okay, come come over to the, the zones. What, why? Oh. Why'd you just stop? Because I thought they were gonna go under us didn't run into them because he had a limp, I didn't want him to have to change direction. Oh no. Okay. Bad it's got a sugar. No, nothing's coming out through the straw. Oh. Uh, so you got a forest walk, but we're apparently in the forest walk. Because they don't feel like no forest walk. Play space, harmony plaza, sunset sunset sun, sunlight plaza, events lawn, forest walk, inspiration garden. Oh I need that. I need to be inspired. Yeah, cool. Let's go for wonder, eh? Let's see what the what the purpose of this place is. It looks cool. Yeah. I've seen a few little places to, to sit, which when I'm shopping oh, yeah. is essential. Oh, cool. Yeah. Well, you can tell it's newly built. Like it, it looks so modern, doesn't it? Yeah. It's pretty cool, you know. I'm assuming that's somewhere. Oh, we got the Are they? Oh, cute. On that raft thing. Cool. Well, this is a cool view, if I'm being honest. Cool view of the city. Oh wow, I'm gonna park to sit over there, stand in a sleigh. Look at all these like places to like walk across. That's a kids park with like little fountain. Whoa, that's cool. I would probably oh my gosh, can I go in? Will they let me? No. Why not? Yes, I am. I'm a child at heart. That's cool. So what I'm noticing is this isn't open either, which would be awesome to sit here and put your feet in the grass amongst the skyscrapers. But it is pretty cool. Looks like all grass areas at this level have grass maintenance in progress. Yeah, all this but blocked off. I guess they're trying to, maybe they're trying to make it green. I don't know. I like it. I like this. I think it looks cool. I think it's like, I think it's like modern. And for me, I love modern. Modern for me is awesome. Look at this. I think it's sick. I like it. Looks like a really cool place to like sit, doesn't it? Yeah. Hmm, I like it. I like it a lot.
I like it even better if I could shoot to four for free. <laughs> All right, well, we're through this side. Um, there's heaps of like levels, as you can see. Tiffany and Co. There's so many like there's so many expensive stores. stores, but I think we're just in the expensive area, but we've been walking for a while and we're still in the expensive area. Um, yeah, I like it. Nas, makeup, found the Sephora, Kiehl's. It's cool. Big show is secret. I actually, I actually like it. I like it. I think it's really cool. It's a cool mall. I like it. It's very spacious. It's got lots of plants. It's probably like $3 million. Just, but Sephora is there. We just discussed, discussed that. Okay. And uh, yeah, I like it. I think it's cool. I like it. I take it back. I came skeptical. I was changed. It's a cool mall. Was it necessary? I'm not sure. It's yeah, cool. Yeah, everyone's having fun. <laughs> and that's the main part of life, right? True. My headache's not letting me have very much fun right now. I'm having a massive headache. But yeah, it's cool. I like it a lot. Nice place to walk around in, to be honest with you. Looks nice, smells nice. Nice stores. A lot of them aren't open yet, but... Lululemon! Oh my goodness. <gasps> oh. I used to buy Lulu all the time and then I switched awesome then I switched to making YouTube videos and I couldn't afford them anymore. <laughs> so uh oh my headache guys. Anyway, I'm gonna look through Sephora, it's probably boring for you guys, so I guess see you in a second. <laughs> oh cool. Sunscreen things. Yeah, you can get the sun things. Okay. Like I said, I'm not gonna buy anything because it I can't, but nice to look to be honest. This is one of the places where if I start, I literally won't stop, so I'm not gonna start. <laughs> and then next minute I can't afford food. <laughs> Alright, and this is the outside part where it is raining and they're digging holes with my massive headache. And it's really hurting me, but we're calling a grab. I think they pick you up from here. So smiling You'll be okay. It hurts. You'll be alright. It's right there. Are right there? Yeah. Ready? No. No, what are you doing? Anyway, that was cool. I liked it. Enjoy it. Cool shops. Rate it. It was fun. The more time we spend there and saw everything, it kind of makes you realize, all right, did, was there a necessity for another mall? No, but it has everything, so you're going to go there. And there's... There's lots of places, a nice place to sit. I don't think there's a nice place to sit in Pavilion. Oh, the downstairs bit. In the middle yeah. of the day, no, but otherwise, yeah. yeah. nice place to sit, I like I it. I love the rooftop thing. There's not enough, like, you have KLCC Park and a couple of other parks, but if you live in this part of town, you can just come here and walk up there for free, why not? Okay, my head's killing you, me. I'll see you in the next one. Vlogmas, like and subscribe. Oh, I've got to drink some water and get some pun at all. Bye. Next one's on a bus. No, it's not. Ooh. <laughs>